treat that everyone likes to eat. But did you know that chocolate, when it was first invented, people did not eat the chocolate but drank chocolate. If you are a big fan of eating chocolates and have, have a sweet tooth, welcome to the story of the chocolate. Chapter 1 Chocolate Drinkers Let's start the chapter 1 in the story of the chocolate, Chocolate Drinkers. A thousand years ago, chocolate was a big secret. Only few people drank it and nobody ate it. The first chocolate drinkers were farmers who lived by the rainforest in the Central America. The rainforest was a jungle full of tropical plants, wild animals and creepy crawlies. It was also home to the small cocoa tree that grew strange bright broad. Monkeys knew all about the pods. They liked to break them open and suck out the sweet white pulp. Then they spat then they spat out the bitter beans that were in the middle. If a bean landed on an earthy patch of a forest floor, it grew into another cocoa tree. One day, a farmer copied the monkeys, monkeys and tasted a pod. Yum! He cried, sucking the pulp. Yuck! He added, spitting out a bean. Soon, everyone was sucking pulp and spitting beans. But then some villagers noticed a delicious smell dif- drifting up from a pile of rotting beans. Over the next few months, the farmers discovered a way to capture the smell by turning the beans into a drink. They let the beans rot for a few days under banana leaves, then put them out to dry in the hot sun. Next, they roasted the beans over fire, ground them into paste and stirred in water and spices. They called their new chocolate drink Chocolba. It tasted very bitter, but they liked it. To avoid hiking into the jungle for pods, the farmers planted cocoa trees in their own fields. The farmers were members of a huge group of people called Mayans. Before long, chocolate bar or chocolate was an important part of the Mayan life. Mayan kings, the price began to drink it every day. They liked the froth best. At Mayan weddings, the bride and groom showed their love for each other by exchanging five cocoa beans. In fact, people were so enchanted by the cocoa tree, they painted it on everything, their pots, their mugs and even the walls. But preparing cocoa beans was hard and took weeks. Most people were only allowed to drink chocolate as a special treat. Cocoa beans became so valuable, they were used as money. You know, there was a time when money grew on trees. You could buy a rabbit for 10 beans and a slave for 100 beans. This was chapter 1, Chocolate Drinkers. You, I will prepare another chapter 2, Learning the Secret. Bye, meet you in the next chapter.